Hi, so in this video we're going to be looking at the business entity concept, which is very simple but very important from an accounting perspective. So the business entity concept states that the financial accounts of a business should only reflect the activities of the business and not the personal activities of its owners. So what this means is that we treat a business as an entity which is separate from its owners. So we have a business is different from the owners. And so just to just to finish off what I've got written down here, we still report flows of money between the owner and the business. So any cash that is withdrawn from the business will be reflected on the financial accounts of that business and any capital that is invested into the business by the owner will again be reflected in the financial accounts because those are activities of the business. They are movements between the owner and business, so they're also activities of the owner, but they obviously reflect how much cash the business will have, so they are business activities. However, once that money has been withdrawn from the business, which is our first point here, then any personal activities that the owner decides to do with the money it's withdrawn from the business, that does not get reflected in the financial accounts, simply because that money is no longer the business or it no longer belongs to the business, it has been withdrawn. So that will show up on, say, the accounts of the owner, but the owner is a separate entity from the business. So that is what the business entity concept is. It's very important from an accounting perspective because it allows us to tax things very separately and to se segregate an owner from a business. So, but quite a simple concept. So just very important to remember that definition. So I hope this video was useful. If it was, please do drop a like rating, check out the playlist for more accounting principles videos and subscribe to add some econ to your subscription feed.